Yo, it's Run 92.3, man. Bootleg Kev, DJ Head, West special Coast. guest. Shorty Shorty is here. Welcome, yeah. goddammit. Thank you. Yeah, man. Uh, Hell yeah. Appreciate it. Give everybody like a quick rundown where you're from, because I feel like everybody knows your song, but they don't know a lot about you, I'm man. I'm from Northeast. I'm from Baltimore. I'm from Northeast Baltimore. Yeah, nigga like to smoke and chill. You like to smoke and chill? Yeah, that's me. Uh, Baltimore. My favorite show of all time is The Wire. Is how how accurate of a, de- a depiction? Not accurate. Not accurate, huh? Not accurate. So you're not a fan of The Wire? No. Really? Oh. I always find that when people like have some uh, like a show that represents the city and you don't fuck with it, it'd be like, man, that's not because I feel like that about L.A. a lot. They disrespected it. Really? They disrespected it. What's the it's most cool. disrespectful part about it? The gangsters nigga on there was gay. Mm. Shout out to uh, Omar Little, yeah. He was not. The gangsters nigga on there was gay, bro. Damn. And that's out. Hey, but he could. There could that's, be a gay gangster. Whoa, that's bro, crazy. that's out of the box. Gotcha. He wouldn't have been walking around the white neighborhood with someone like. Everybody just dispersing. So you did watch the show. You oh, just yeah? you didn't fuck with it. Nah, I turn it off when in situations like that. Gotcha. You feel me? Gotcha. It get too. It get too. Passionate. I feel like that about a lot of shows about LA. So it's the same thing. So I can yeah. yeah. I, see, you see, and I know y'all get a lot of that. <laughs> a <laughs> lot, of that. lot of that. It ain't really that many shows set in Baltimore. Nah, so. but it's movies though. Gotcha. You be like, hold up, come on, man. Why they ain't put that neighborhood in there? Well, why they ain't go right? So I know y'all got gotcha. you. Got gotcha. you. Uh, Baltimore, obviously, a, a, a city that I feel like doesn't get a lot of recognition in hip hop. Why do you think that is? I don't know. Niggas like to be statistics at the end of the day, bro. Our niggas is dumb, for real. I ain't even gonna hold you. They dumb, bro. You feel me? And a lot of niggas, some some got the talent and some ain't patient. You feel me? So it's that's a lot of following in my city, bro. You feel me? You feel yeah. like the city is full of followers? Not really. I mean, you got you got. Uh, a hand few, bro, that that do their own thing, and then you got that other bundle that want to be the hand few. Mm-hmm. Like, nobody want to be actually themselves. Like, you self, 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 self. It's five or six between six to ten people that's really, like, bubbling, and everybody else want to be them six to ten people. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's what's up. Uh, dude, what about the is is the bubbling scene of the artists like? Do, is it a camaraderie? Do people get along? Is yeah, it, yeah. Okay, for sure. Yeah, it's yeah. a lot of we, unity. Yeah, yeah. But I mean, it's it's still outside of music. It's it's territorial. Got you. You feel me? Yeah, I know exactly. So what you like, it ain't too much you can do. It really ain't too much you can do. Do you feel like the um the music will ever transcend street shit? Will the music ever be bigger than the street shit to where the street shit won't necessarily matter as much? No, I dig it. I, 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 I feel you, but nah. As no. long as I mean, long as it's always bad blood, man. It's spilled blood, man. You can't really do too much with that. Got you. You dig what I'm saying? Yeah. Too much spilled blood. You can't do too much with that. So I mean, you could be want to be cool with anybody. You dig what I'm saying? But how that's gonna go? Cause if you done did something to his people's or his people's done did something to your people's, like it's politics. How that's gonna go? Uh, how long have you been rapping, man? Give us a little. Five years. Five years. Yeah. What? What? Like, at what point in time did you realize like you could actually make a career out of this shit, or like you had something going for you? Like huh. Two years ago, and niggas started getting paid. Yeah, <laughs> started getting them shows. Yeah, yeah. getting show money, doing some clubs. Yeah, nigga, like, all right. So all the week, the whole week, I was trying to gamble up twenty five hundred. I just walked in the spot, stood there for fifteen minutes, twenty minutes, but did my own little thing. And left out of there with twenty five hundred something. I was trying to scramble up in a week. You feel me? Right. That man, kind of the positive, kind of outweighs the negative. Right. For sure, man. You know I, mean? I feel like Bet You was a record that obviously, when we heard it, we're like, oh, this is some West Coast shit. <laughs> this is some bang shit. I tapped into y'all culture. Hell yeah, yeah. Ollie was already fucking with some LA niggas from out here for real. Uh, shout out to my nigga Ollie for real. My my man locked up for real right now for mm-hmm. real, but. You from Watts. You feel yeah. me? From the other side of Watts, for real. So I was already tapping in with them, and they was like, feed me, like, um, Sacramento artists and yeah. the Bay artists and yeah. shit like that. And they like, yo, tap in. You, you fuck with that music? I'm like, damn, I fuck with this shit. This shit hard, cuz. I'm all the way from the East Coast. Yeah. And I'm like, damn, this shit hard, cuz. Like, why ain't... Fuck it, let me start tapping in more. And as I tapped into y'all culture, bro, I was fucking. I appreciate that. You know what I'm saying? You showing the love because a lot of times I'm from LA, so like a lot of times it'd be like weird. Yeah, well, and shit I like dig that. It. The um, let me ask you this: When you do you get backlash from your side for for embracing our shit well, like no. that? No, but no. One, one thing I know another 
and everything, bro. I'm so different to the point I never care. And nigga know I don't care. So I don't give a fuck what you saying. Right. right. Like, you ain't paying no bills, bro. You. <laughs> but yeah, for real, that's how I go, bro. You're not paying no bills, so I could care less what a nigga got to say, bro. You feel me? Tap in. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Like, you don't know what you're missing. For real, for real, if you got something to say what I'm saying, bro, or what I'm doing, you don't know what you're missing, obviously. You feel me? Because yeah. I done tapped into the West Coast, and now I'm really, you feel me? Got shit going on over here. Hell yeah. I think niggas need to go ahead and tap into the West Coast because it's females over this bitch. It's, it's weather over this bitch. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's a little ugly outside know, right man. now. Yeah, you mean, know what I'm saying? But yeah, bro, y'all get, y'all get good weather, man. Love. Like nine times out of ten of the, 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 the year, y'all got good weather. Dude. Love, bro. No snow and shit? Nah. Right. Nah. Dumb, bro. Yo, how, uh, obviously the DMV, I got family from Maryland, um, you know, Baltimore, D.C., so close to each other in proximity, but so different at the same time, right? Yeah, I tap into D.C. too. Well, what, what would you describe like that difference? Because the, the cities are so close to each other, but I feel like they're, 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 they're you know, they feel Ain't different. Ain't no difference no more. No difference. Ain't no difference no more. We all the same. DMV, we all the same. It's too small for us to be like, I ain't, I'm the one that's stamping that. You dig what I'm saying? I don't even think it was no ever, ever no artist to be like, oh yeah, it is a different. There's no difference, man. That's dope. We all get down the same way. We all doing the same thing. It's just different strokes for different folks, man. I, I heard somebody really take offense to the DMV thing. Like they was like, no, it's like different. I don't remember who it was, but is that a thing out there or no? Who took offense? If you if you took offense, he ain't really in. The, who was it? I don't, I don't <laughs> remember. Matter of fact, it don't even it don't matter. matter. He ain't yeah. in the streets, bro. Okay. He ain't tapped in. You that's what I'm, that's what I'm saying, you. bro. You talking some fool shit? You ain't tapped in. You ain't getting no money neither. Mm. You too territorial to get money. Bro, you dig what I'm saying? Yeah. When you when you want to get money, bro, you're going to brighten your horizon. You're going to stretch it. You ain't just going to get money in the neighborhood. Right. Farther money, the, the farthest money that you're going to get in the neighborhood is neighborhood money. Is you playing with me? I feel you. Bro, I'm not trying to get no neighborhood money. <laughs> I'm bro. trying to get it the yeah, world. Exactly. Yeah. So if you're saying something like that, like, it's something different. It's nothing different, bro. We all trying to get out of DMV. It's all, we got all the same politics. You feel me? DC really got it worse. They get locked up, go straight to the feds. Mm -hmm. You feel me? Like, mm. you live in the city of DC, you get locked up. They got a city jail, but you get locked up, you go straight to the feds. So they kind of, you feel That's me? That's crazy. Is it is it very is it real strict out there? Because I know New York got the DC? gun shit. Yeah, the gun shit. Uh, where yeah, I mean, you ain't going to be 15 minutes away from the fucking president acting the ass. Yeah. You can smoke <laughs> out there now, right? Is the yeah. weed laws. Yeah, the weed laws are yeah, a lot more good. chill now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, you good on the weed and shit. Yeah. Yeah, that's crazy. So, I mean, yeah, we might from Baltimore. I mean, from Baltimore, but Maryland, too. They had to, like, drop the situation. So, Maryland, we can smoke. We're in Maryland, too, now. Who are, um, obviously, you know, being from Baltimore, it's East Coast, but what were some of your influences coming up? Like, like, what's some of your favorite albums or artists, like, coming up, man? Um, Wiz. Shout out to Wiz, yeah. You feel me? From Pittsburgh. Of man. course. Um, yeah, folks. Uh, Wiz, Fatty Y. He's from Jersey. And I still keep me talking to Fatty. Um, Rich Homie Corn, I'm in touch with him. Yeah. Um, I listen to a lot of, a lot of different music, bro. Like I never really was, like one of them. Oh, I only listen to this. I listened to Drizzy a lot growing up. You feel me? A lot of Drake. That's why I got like, all right, you, you, you could be where you from and make your own music. It is what it is. You know sure. what I'm saying? Um, Bushy, like I'm from Baltimore, so. <laughs> shit, right. You feel me? Yeah, Bushy's the guy. Boosie, um, yeah, that's why I grew up listening to. A lot of genres of music, but majority of those guys was Fetty Wap, um, uh, Rich Homie Kwan, uh, Wiz Khalifa, Boosie. Who you think really gets credit for starting like the melody shit on the East Coast? Hmm? Hmm. I don't know because it kind of like it transverse because it's R and it's like uh, it's a little bit like R and B with them when it comes to, like being melodic. It's melodic rap, like you understand what I'm saying. So it's kind of like I really don't. I really don't know. Only person I can actually like give give him the the. I mean, I gotta give him his props when it's due, bro. I I started harmonizing and rapping. Rich Homie Quan. That's when I started Quan. like rapping. Yeah, Quan, man. Quan's. I feel like Quan's low key like he was the father of a lot of these guys, man. He was crazy. Bro. He got He he's just one record away from being back, yeah, cause he's such a good dude. You know, he. Had, he I, so unfortunately, I know he was like locked out of being able to release music for a he's while. He's a good too. guy, bro. Though. Solid dude. Yeah. Uh, all right, so I, you know, I know you said your album's almost finished. What, what, you played us some shit, and the shit is slapping. Yeah. Um, you got any features on the album? Or? Um, Shoreline. Shoreline's on the album? Um, Juice World, 
Oh wow, okay. And um, yeah. All right, one more, bro. One more. Keep it su- keep it simple. Yeah, one more. All right, little baby, or something like that. What was it like doing uh, the something in the water festival? I saw you were over there. I was cool. I was all right. Were you able to tap in with Pharrell? Um, nah, I didn't get to see Pharrell. I seen um Slim Jimmy though. Me and Slim Jimmy yeah. tapped in. That was my guy. I fucked with him. Yeah. What about in your free time? What is Shorty Shorty doing? You watching Netflix? You watching Game of Thrones? I'm smoking weed, <laughs> bro. I be playing a game a little bit. What you be bro. playing? Uh, 2K. I be playing mm-hmm. a lot of squad games. Are you on the two? Are you raw in 2K? I'm paper on it. Okay. Paper What's on your it, squad bro. on 2K though? Um, I don't really, I don't really got no squad, but I play. You run with anybody? Yeah, I play with. with That's a bet. Play with. That's a bet. I'm a match a team, bro. I'm not going to... You feel me? I'm not going to outmatch you. Run with, the, like, run with the Warriors every time. Every... Pacers against the Warriors. Yeah. <laughs> like, come on. Like, like, all right, man. if you're going to be the Pacers, I'll be the... Yeah, I could be the Wizards. All right, I'm going to play with the Rockets or something like play that. I'm going to match Hawks. a team. Yeah, I'm going to match a team. That's the Hawks. <laughs> You gotta play him with the magics. <laughs> <laughs> hey, well, we appreciate you coming through, man. Uh, the record is on fire. I know you got a remix coming soon. Yeah. Uh, so well, I guess to be determined, who's gonna be on that? To be determined. Hey, real quick, what's the inspiration behind the song, man? Like, cause I I, I have my own speculation, but it it was no inspiration. It was yo, bro. Listen, this is how crazy it is, and I love telling the story. Um, I was I was on the phone on the phone with a bitch. And then, real shit. I swear to God, I can't give him no respect. You get no respect. This chain you, is literally when you, do, a, when you do certain shit like that, bro. You can't get no respect, bro. Certain females is females, and they're women. And certain females is bitch, and they know they are. So you have to like address, address them. Address them accordingly. Thank you. Okay. I'm on the phone with the bitch. You feel me? Right. <laughs> I'm on the phone with the bitch. You feel me? <laughs> listen, listen, listen. So I hear a homegirl on the phone with another nigga. She hang the phone up. So she ain't gonna phone up with him like five minutes after that, get on the phone with somebody else. I'm like, whoa. So I automatically brainstorm, like, damn. As soon as I get off the phone with this bitch, she gonna get on the phone with another nigga. I'm like, bitch, you a dog and your own girl too. <laughs> hey, cuz, boot up real quick. Boy, pull that shit up real quick. That nigga, shout out to YG, yo. Shout out to my, my uh, producer, man. He put that shit together. It's lit. Damn. Well. That's an epic ass story, by the way. I shot that shit to my homies from over here. They was like, boy, that shit is slap. That's, That's the first time I ever heard slap before. He like, boy, this bitch is slap. Yeah. Push this bitch over here. All right. Yo, all right. yeah, Young Pinch is who put me onto the record. Yeah, wow, man. Yo. Shout out to Pinch, man. Yeah, well, yo, we appreciate you tapping in with us, bro. The record is fire. Introduce it for L.A. Uh, yo, this shorty shorty. And I'm with 92.3. Hey. The real guys right here. Yeah. <laughs> and, yeah, this is my song, Bachelor. There you go. So, it's real 92. And your own girl, too. Right. <laughs> <laughs>